welcome everyone to uh, the first City Showcase Student Athlete Symposium. South Bronx United started hosting a college showcase five years ago. We have three teams. Uh, this year we started to partner with, with Downtown United. We've had 56 teams, almost a thousand kids, boys and girls, all at Randall's Island. Today was just a, a, an awesome opportunity to come down here, um, catch some great soccer games earlier in the day. Um, the tournament, the weather was great, the level of competition was excellent, um, and, and then wrap up the evening, uh, you know, being able to answer some, some very important um, and, and good questions, and, and hopefully pass on some information to, to the, young, the young boys and girls and, and help them as they begin their college search. And it's exciting, especially for me on the women's side, to see how much the game is growing for uh, girls players that are playing in New York City. I think one of the biggest pieces that, that we've had this year is, is the College Showcase Student Athlete Symposium with great, great, great guests, uh, Claudia Reyna. I was around your age when, when I started to think about college. I went to the University of Virginia. Um, it was probably the best time of my life. Uh, as you said, you're with peers, you get to play the sport you love, you go into school. Jack Ivkovich from uh, CUNY Athletic Conference. The benefits of you walking onto a college campus and having instant friends on your team because you have a vested interest in your coach and in your teammates that want you around for four years, that want you doing well in school, that want you to progress towards a degree by being part of that team that is so important at, at, at any level on any team. And an amazing panel of, of college coaches. We were honored to be asked to moderate and to help have input into the infrastructure of the symposium this evening. I think that the panel addressed just about every topic thoroughly. What's been great for us is, is really being able to engage our students more in the college process uh, with the addition of our, our educational programming and college prep program and be able to really tie that, tie in the college uh, prep piece with the soccer. Sort of like the player I was. I wasn't a tricky player or anything. I was very simple. I think it's very important in life as well to keep it very sim simple, stay focused, work hard, think about tomorrow, listen to the people that are close to you. And lastly as well, you guys are also role models. It's not just uh, looking at people uh, older than you. There's also people younger than you that are watching you guys. If you don't take care of those academics first, you'll have no chance of progressing to university. I can guarantee you that the professional clubs want to have educated, well-rounded, good human beings on top of being quality soccer players. The main thing I have to say to all the students is, you're a student athlete, student athlete. So if you can't get it done first in the classroom, chances of you continuing playing in college is not going to work. And in comparison to other showcases, uh, I think the level of play is, is certainly very high. And I think the unique, uh, the uniqueness to the to this showcase is um, the interactions that you get to have with the coaches and the club directors and things like that. I just think that this showcase has a much more personal feel. I think one of the great things this year has been really our partnership with Downtown United, and and our, our support from New York City FC and Growth Through Sport. And, and Anglo Sports, um, and they've all been really helpful making, making this a great event.